how you're all doing welcome to this in light tutorial in this in light tutorial we're going to continue with our four part four picture collage and we're going to go on to part two if you haven't seen part one so part one we just um, completed this double um, double exposure tutorial and basically what we're going to end up with is this four piece collage with these effects as well i thought i'd do the frog as part two i know i said in some of the comments i'd do different one but i thought i'd do the frog in part two because the frog is probably the easiest one so basically you're gonna have the the uh, black and white background with the frog in color and it's quite nice that you could you could use this on on lots of pictures it doesn't have to be this one so the picture like i said will be in the uh, description below and part one the link to that will be in the description below unless i can put it on the screen then it'll be on the screen if i can so i'm just going to tap the um tap my screen to get my tools and then I'm going to go to image sorry got to go to um, filters and then I'm going to go to black and white filter and I am going to use scroll along and use this low key filter the reason I'm using this low key filter is if you notice it's compared to the others just for this image it's softer so it's like a softer effect and that's what I'm looking for this so soft effect so that's what it looked like I'm just pressing these two um, squares in the bottom right corner that's what it looked like and that's what it looks like now I'm just gonna slide my finger along until I get the effect to between 50 and 60 percent um, applied and then what we're gonna do we're gonna tap our tools sorry we're gonna tap our mask and simply we're gonna make sure this wipe on the left hand side is highlighted in blue by just tapping it and then I'm just gonna zoom in I'm just gonna zoom in and I'm going to go over the frog so basically we're wiping away the effect and I'm not being too careful either because if I go over the lines let me show you um, and just color all this in let's say I go over the lines like this all I'm simply going to do is select apply at the bottom and then just go around and apply the effect again so I go back to wipe and continue wiping away the effect that we don't want that's the black and white in this case and like I said I'm not being overly cautious with this because if I make a mistake like I just did there all I'm simply going to do is just select the apply and just apply the black and white effect back where I want it applied to So I'm just going to go around the outline and like I said again I'm not too fussed about if I go over the lines I'm just going over the lines now I'm going around the outline if I can now it's not taking too long you can see there's my outline done there's the inside of the frog complete that's all I'm going to do I'm just going to click the apply button and just go around the parts that I've gone over the lines like so and um, and that's how we're going to leave our, our frog just for now and then we're going to click the little tick button to accept those changes and then we're going to go to image we're going to go to adjust and we're going to scroll along until we find this um, gusto effect here now what the gusto does if you look at the background here the gusto will just smooth just sort of gray gray it out a little bit apply like a um, a film filter so it just makes it again a little bit smoother and you could use others as well it doesn't matter um, this withered sometimes is quite a nice effect like this I think and also the ink print if you if you select the imprint and um, and don't and just apply about 30% but the withered if you if you sort of apply quite a bit 70% to it it looks quite nice but like I said I'm just going to use this gusto Sierra is quite good as well it smooths it out but for me the gusto just does it a little bit better whilst leaving the colors here quite prominent it sort of grays out or applies that nice film to the background to allow us to see all of the background instead of making all of the background dark so I'm gonna click the little tick button and then all we're simply gonna do now is go to filters go to duo 
and then we're just going to add this vignette to it so where we made the the background um, light or, or applied that gusto film we're just going to ease that that sort of effect in by applying a vignette so the outers are dark really dark but it gets a little bit um, lighter as it comes into the inside like so and then once we're done that's me simple as simple as that really really quick we're going to save that out so i'm just going to tap the button up here and then um, save that image out so then let's um let's put this into our our four piece collage let's put these two images that we've got now so let's go to tap the screen and go to finalize go to collage select the four so you can select the areas where you want the images but just by tapping it so if i want that image somewhere else i could have it somewhere else but i'm going to have the um the other image here so it's put the frog there in the corner for me i'm going to select the one that's diagonal it diagonal to it i'm going to go to end light at the bottom and then i'm going to tap this filter this um this image here tap it again and then i can just pinch and squeeze and resize that image and once we've got that i'm quite happy with that image now we can leave that until we come to our next image obviously um, either the flowers or the floating tree whichever one i decide to do but i will do it quite quickly so um that's where we've got to now um i will try and rotate these other two um so you can put a four within a four if you want to let me just change that back um change that back sorry there we go so i'm going to try and do these other two um these other two two images quite quickly as well quite um, follow that follow that around quite quickly and um and yeah so that's the um, that's the frog um thanks a lot for watching and i'll um, i'll catch you very soon